a sad beginning for dancing bears. Due to which those terrific marks remain on their nose for lifetime. Cops are trained using cruel methods. <coughs> begins the cruel and his rebel <coughs> This is the main entrance from where people enter. Those are the foods prepared and workers feed them to the animals twice a day. The kitchen seems to be a bit far from the area where such tortured animals are isolated. The hungry bears are already waiting for the food to be served. They know it is the meal time now, so they would just scream and make noises before their food arrives. This is their calling for the food. Workers struggle to clean post meal every day in order to keep their premises as neat as possible. Bears are very fond of watermelons, which is why workers try to keep them happy, serving them once in the afternoon every day. They would either keep them on the branches or keep throwing them randomly at different places where they may possibly come and then leave. Once they hear the sound of vehicle close to the moon, they would follow running and demanding the melons to be thrown. Bears expect the melons at around 1 pm in the noon. This is their play area where they come for together fun and enjoyment. They call it enlightenment area. There were total 79 bears rescued, out of which 32 were males and 42 females. This is quite more peaceful, arranged for the injured bears so that they can rest. This is the home treatment room where their possible treatments are okay. done. Okay. Thank you.
Sylvia on the Ada Conservation Center of Wildlife SOS in Agra. Tortured elephants from all over the world are rescued and taken care here. This is the place of treatment as well. Thank you.